All right, what's up, Modern Bay Tribe? Uh, Travis here with the Modern Bay Company. We do Subaru conversions into Volkswagen Bay window buses, as you guys know. And today I'm gonna do a quick wrap on shock absorbers. So uh, if you need shocks for your bus, if that ride is getting a little, little wavy, a little crazy, uh, you're going around those turns and you're feeling a lot of roll, um, and you haven't replaced your shocks uh, ever, which is in a lot of people's case, or um, if they just need to be replaced, we're gonna talk about a couple options and then I'm gonna show you how to adjust uh, these guys, uh, the Kony shocks. So um, by far what most people do when they replace the shocks on their bay window buses is they go to the internet <laughs> and they order something like these guys, which are the KYB GR2s. Um, I think these guys, uh, last I checked, if you order them online, uh, they're like 20 to 30 bucks a piece. So they're relatively cheap. They're relatively easy to swap out, uh, whichever shock you end up going with. Uh, if you go with these guys, uh, you do need to buy the little add-on kit that has these little collars uh, that fit right into there. Uh, but again, it's like another eight bucks or something for that little kit. So um, not a huge deal. But uh, for most people, these are fine. Uh, if you happen to want the best ride possible, uh, you can upgrade. Um, I feel like a little like Mario thing should happen there, like upgrade, ding, uh, <laughs> to Kony shocks. So, um, and I'll put this guy right there. I don't know if this is the front or the rear. Uh, there's a part number for that guy. Um, Kony shocks are not cheap. Uh, I think it's like 650 or 700 bucks for a set if you can find them. Um, and you oftentimes cannot find them because everyone loves them and orders them off the shelves as soon as they hit the shelves at places like Bus Depot and otherwise. So uh, if you can find them uh, and you wanna spend the coin to get the best ride possible, go for it. Uh, this is what they look like. And the only thing about Kony shocks that's different from your standard like KYB shocks or whatever brand shock you go with, these are adjustable. Uh, so you can make your ride smoother or stiffer depending on your preference depending on uh, how loaded down you may or may not be uh, for the trip coming up or whatever that is. So uh, the way that the adjustment works on these guys is you bottom them out, so you push them all the way down and then you turn them and you can kind of feel, there's a little, uh, I wanna say detent, you can kind of feel if it's engaged or not. If you go back and forth, I don't know if you can hear this, probably. Um, so I've engaged the point where we can actually adjust them now and if we go, these have two turns of adjustment. So you can kind of mark with a Sharpie or with your thumb and say, we're all the way out counterclockwise. And then uh, that's uh, counterclockwise is as soft as it gets. And then if you, you know, are still pushing in and you turn, you can feel it turning with you. If you go out one turn, uh, well, that's medium, right? Between as soft and as stiff as it gets. And if you go a full two turns out, that is as stiff as your ride is gonna get. If you're super loaded down, um, then you know, maybe you wanna go as stiff as possible. Uh, a lot of folks recommend starting out, uh, sort of breaking them in at uh, a half turn. And then from there, once you've driven a few hundred miles, um, do the kind of final adjustment for, well, for your you know, typical driving. Uh, you can always adjust them on the fly. But uh, what I'm gonna set mine out, what I'm gonna set this bus at, um, is one turn out because it's gonna be a little more loaded down. I know that already, and I'm not gonna be around to adjust these later on. Uh, so instead of like running them in and then setting it on its final, I'm just gonna go ahead and set it to what I think will be the final, which is about one turn out. Uh, and then once you do that, you can go ahead and of course install these guys. Um, as with all my stuff, I actually kit out these uh, little hardware kits. Uh, I replace all the kind of old and funky hardware with nice new stuff, um, just because if we're in there, if we're doing it, we might as well uh, go all the way. That's just how we work here. So that's the wrap. Uh, that's the wrap, Kony Shocks, KYB Shocks. As always, give us a shout in the comments, um, shoot us an email, give us a call if we can help with anything. And thank you guys for tuning in, bye.